Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. Have been no strangers to using the January transfer market in the past to make some changes to their squad. And Wednesday's defeat to Atalanta could push Jurgen Klopp into wanting two deals done. Klopp made a handful of changes to the Champions League game against Atalanta. Reese Williams, Neko Williams and Costas Zmikias joined Joel Matip in defence to give Fabinho and Andy Robertson a rest. Roberto Firmino and Diogo Jota were also given time to recover ahead of Saturday's match against Brighton. Divock Origi was given a rare start up front, lining up alongside Sadio Mane and the returning Mohamed Salah. But Liverpool's front line lacked their usual cutting edge for most of the match. Arigi has seen his minutes massively diminish this season following Hotas' incredible start to life at Anfield. Prior to the game against Atalanta, he had played just three matches all season. The Belgian forward, who has built a cult status at Anfield for some famous goals over the years, needs to grasp any opportunity with both hands. But he failed to do so against Atalanta before being hauled off by Klopp at the hour mark, just after Liverpool conceded. Jota and Firmino were brought on to try and provide some more spark going forward. The injuries in midfield though have meant Klopp has limited options to bring in more creative players. Jair Donchuk Eri has often filled in as the attacking midfielder this campaign, but he's continued to suffer from niggling injuries. Given Liverpool's already long list of injuries, Klopp will need players he can count on heading into the business end of the season. And according to, both Shakiri and Origi are valued close to £15 million each. Much of the focus for Liverpool heading into January has been on bringing in defensive recruits and that was made clear with the goals they conceded against Atalanta. While Rhys Williams may prove to be a good squad player, Klopp won't want to rely on picking the defender on a regular basis in big games. And selling both Origi and Shakiri would prove Liverpool with enough cash to re-inject back into the squad and find more than adequate cover in defence. Going forward has not been a problem for Liverpool with Jota, Firmino, Salah and Main all in good form while Klopp still likes Takumi Minamino. But it's in defence where Liverpool could be tested due to long-term injuries to both Joe Gomez and Virgil van Dijk. Klopp will want to rectify that sooner rather than later and £30 million from Origi and Shaqiri would go some way to helping them solve that.